An agglomerated ingredient really is pretty simple. An agglomerated ingredient is where you're gluing together your fine particles. Basically, when you take a powder and you pour it into water, you'll see that the outside of the, that particle mass wets out first, and it actually prevents the water from penetrating into your particles on the inside. So you have dry particles on the inside and wet on the outside. What agglomeration does is it glues multiple particles together with bridges that allow water to flow in between those particles so that the water actually attacks all of or maximizes the surface area that the water can get to on an agglomerated particle. In other words, multiple particles glued together with bridges between them. Now, those bridges get really interesting when you start thinking, what are those bridges composed of? We can agglomerate with water, for instance, or we can add modifiers to that water, such as gums, starches, other hydrocolloids. So the bridges can either be made stronger or weaker, depending on what you're trying to accomplish. Agglomeration by IFP is accomplished by using fluid bed processing. In other words, we're blowing the particles up in the air, we're creating an atomized zone, either of water or water with a binder in it. And so the droplet size of your binder is gonna impact multiple particles and start creating those bridges to create your structured particulates. Those particles continue to blow through that zone or cloud, building more and more particles together until you have a homogeneous particle size built up by multiple particles being glued together by agglomeration.